Hey everyone, Mike Sherry here with Paul Sherry Ram. I've got the biggest Ram that Ram builds to show you today. This is a Ram 5500 cabin chassis that's been upfitted with a 16 foot Bay Bridge box on the back here. Uh, this truck right here is meant to haul. It has a huge carrying capacity. Uh, you know, we also sell box trucks on like a, a van chassis like we get here. Uh, that's meant to haul, but it doesn't have as large a carrying capacity as, as this does. So customers that buy these uh, box trucks on the 5500 are looking for the carrying capacity. They haul some heavy material uh, and they want to be safe and, and uh, also have a chassis underneath it that, that can support it. And this, by all means, can do that. Uh, I'm going to start talking about the box and then we'll jump into the chassis side. Uh, I do want to mention just one thing on the chassis. It does have that optional Cummins diesel on it, which I know a lot of you appreciate and that's what you're looking for. So I wanted to mention that. All right, so onto the box. So it's 16 foot long. It's aluminum skinned, has extruded aluminum corners up here on the bulkhead, diamond plate up top there for protection. It's a pretty much smooth finish here, so if you want to add different uh, uh, custom graphics or anything like that, or maybe even put a full wrap on it, you can. Again, super beefy chassis. The undercarriage has been uh, coated in a rust proof here. Dual rear wheels. Now I've done these videos with the ramp out. I want to do one with the ramp in. So if you're looking for the ramp out, just look on our page. I've got a video of it up there. Uh, so I want to start with the door down and ramp in. Uh, you can put this ramp out with one person, but you need two hands. And of course, fortunately, I've got one with this camera. But I did want to show you how it stowed up underneath here. Pretty slick. You don't even see it from the side or anything. Fits right in between the frame rails there. Uh, it's just over two foot wide from here to here. Then the actual deck space and it's 12 foot long. Uh, they just started in the last couple we got in putting these parking sensors in this rear bumper which is super nice. Uh, this is a steel bumper. It's a foot wide here so easily can get your foot on it. I got LED backup lights and uh, tail lights here and then it's got the uh, Bay Bridge winning door on it. So it works uh, similar to the garage door. It's going to have cables and springs. And then up there in the center, you've got a backup camera. Uh, so it's nice with having the backup camera and those sensors. It'll actually tell you about how far away you are. I'll show you that on the, on the screen when we get inside. So it's got a big latch here. It's a lockable latch. And really with almost little effort, it goes up because it's spring assisted, cable driven. I got a light right here. It's going to turn on that center light there. But the ceiling in this is actually transparent. Not a, when it's daylight out, there doesn't have to be a bright sunny day. It, this box is lit up fully closed because the ceiling on it is transparent. So that's nice that they do that. Front wall does have some insulation uh, factor to it. It's got tie downs, two on both of the long walls. Fully finished out in plywood on the walls here. The floor is two by six. This is shiplap material and bolted down every foot. Definitely a durable, can take the beating LED light right there. Full warranty on this by, from Bay Bridge. Got a handle on both sides too to help you get in and out if you're not going up the ramp. Got our fuel fill back here and also got a mud flap back here. DEF fill up here. All right, so let's talk about chassis. So chassis again is the 5500, which is the largest offering from Ram. It does have the 6.7 liter Cummins, and it is an automatic transmission. Dove ha does have the optional chrome front bumper and grille surround. That's an option on it. Uh, it's got the new mirrors on it, uh, which is the sliding mirrors instead of the flip up mirrors that Ram's used for over a decade. These just slide in and out manually, easy to use. Seating in this is going to be work grade. Uh, vinyl so that's nice and then we've got uh, vinyl flooring down here and then you do have storage in this chassis behind here even some hanging storage if you want straps and things like that that uh, you hang up and keep them organized all right I got the air blasting let me turn that down so it doesn't sound like a wind tunnel in here 
Comfortable chassis to drive, has all the comfort features that you used to find on vehicles now. This is not decontented, uh, it is well equipped. So I'll go over them with you today. You got 212 miles on it. That's just the, the distance to drive this to get the box put on. It's got a full warranty from Ram and from Bay Bridge. Steering wheel is comfortable with cruise control, gearing control, and hands-free connectivity. The hands-free connectivity is actually an option on this track. Uh, so you can talk on your cell phone hands-free which a lot of states require that, a lot of businesses are starting to require that. Automatic headlights, and then you do have uh, uh, remote control mirrors right here, which is nice. Get the right side here. You can actually control both mirror faces. There's the cat eye and the big one above. I don't know if you can see. I just moved each one independently. Uh, so you can do that with just by pressing that button to switch from what mirror you want to do and then what side. Autom uh, automatic power windows and a locks storage in the door. Uh, this is a uh, three passenger and then also has keyless entry with panic. And let me flip this up. This is your third seat if you need it. Otherwise, it's your center console with beverage holders, storage, USB power, all that. Column shifter, push button start. 8.4 inch touchscreen radio and then we put it in reverse this is your backup screen so they replaced the rear view monitor which would be useless when you got a big box back there but this nice big screen here and it's color it tells you where you're getting close left corner left center right center right corner uh, with those backup sensors that's nice a uh let's see here am fm radio I've got to watch myself some stuff doesn't have am radio anymore uh so that's nice and then uh Got your phone connectivity and USB connectivity, and you can go into vehicle options here. So, all that there. The factory rear camera is up there now. Uh, volume and tuning, heat and air, and then you do have trailer brake controller, and then uh, up to four auxiliary inputs here, and tow haul and exhaust brake. This does not have a trailer tow hitch on it, um, but it if you find someone that want to add one for you, you already got the electronic brake controller. Uh, we've got USBs and then a uh, change organizer and a spot down there for storage. So, Customers that buy these absolutely love them. I know they've been hard to get the last couple years. We do have a couple in stock as of shooting this video, uh, but uh, give us a call to make sure we still have availability before you come. If we don't have one in stock, chances are we have one coming or on order, so maybe we can put your name on it as well. Uh, if you do get uh, successful enough to call in when this is available, we'd love to hear your business on it. Just let us know how. Take care.